I was short at the beginning. However, I would say that since I participate into the advocacy overseas, I was somehow prepared. The invitation against me will come sooner or later. I've been wanted uh, with other charges, so being on the wanted list is not something new. But being on a bounty list is definitely something new. So I had to look into it, what does it entail and whether it will give a lot of incentive for the people around me and also in the UK to turn me out or provide any information of sensitive um, privacy data of me, like where I live or where I pop out at lunch, etc. That is the long arm policy of China and of Hong Kong. The government doesn't want to recognize or intentionally trying to distort uh, the idea that Hong Kong people has the agency to resist. We resist because we believe that things could be better. We deserve democracy and autonomy. <laughs> The burden on us is still much less than what the people in Hong Kong are bearing. So we should uh, you know, make use of the freedom we enjoy here in a free country to continue to voice out for the Hong Kong people, especially for those who cannot speak out the truth.